Hey guys, this is Karen with Planning with Care Bear, and I have a little bit of a different video for you today. Um, I was showing my husband um, what I had been doing today, and he recommended for me to film a video for you guys. And um, if you're crafty, this is like hands down something that you will love doing. What I'm going to be showing y'all how I was making dividers for my stickers. Let's show you guys. Let me pull you guys up some. So this one is the one I made for January. This washi is Planner Kate and this is Simply Gilded. This Dream Love Plan down here is a sticker out of Erin Condren's sticker book. I just wrote this January. I scripted it in this Uniball Signo Broad White Pen. I also have... Um, I also have a silver one somewhere. Yeah, here it is right here. But I found, I'm gonna, I will try it with you guys, but I have found that the white shows up better. And I like doing these on black paper. And these, this is, uh, I'll show you the paper in a minute. But because I like the way this pops. And then this is the one I did for February. This is Simply Gilded. I've got this XOXO sticker from, again, Erin Condren's sticker book. And I wrote it on an angle. This is the one I did for March. Again, uh, an Erin Condren sticker. I printed it this time, and I done it this way, and this is Simply Gilded. So, oh, and I did, uh, I also did April. Let me get in there. April's my daughter's birthday month, so this is, um, again, Simply Gilded. And then these stickers are from the Erin Condren, back of the Erin Condren planner. And then I just wrote it down. So, um, you are, you are your own limitation as far as what you, um, will do. I do have over here, um, I've already picked out some washi that I'm going to use. I've got some scotch washi. Some Erin Condren washi, Planner K washi, and Simply Gilded washi. I just wanted to show you guys how you could do in using all of those. I also have the matching washi that I'm going to do for May is this one. And it's this um, folk tale from a Simply Gilded surprise box. I do have the stickers for that. I've got this... Um, Men's Century Circle sticker book. I've got the Flora sticker book. I've got the Layers sticker book. And there's, I think it's two different books in here. And then this is one I found most of those stickers from. I've got that one. That is edition three. I got this brand new when they were having the warehouse sale. I've got these recollection stickers. I don't know if I'll use any of these. I've got the Create 365, the Happy Planner. This one is the seasonal. When I got this at the store, it was marked down drastically because of it being cut. But I guess maybe just a box cutter. Probably cut this. And then there's a couple of pages in here that is... I just one. I must have took one of them out because I know there was two. So I've got that. And then this one is the watercolor. This one is the student. And then this one is the Christmas. So those are the sticker books that I will be pulling from if I put any stickers down. And if I do them like the others, I will put stickers down. And then this is the Create Creatology. And this is the heavyweight construction paper. All I need, all I did was use this. You don't even have to have this, but I used a paper cutter or paper trimmer. And then, like I showed you guys, I have the white pen. It's the one I used, but I may use silver. I've got a craft knife, pair of scissors, just in case I need some intricate cuts. And I've just got a hole punch here. So, what I'm going to do first is, um, 
I'm going, I didn't like the way a couple of my sheets, um, I somehow, I don't know what I was doing when I hole punched those, but I didn't get the holes punched in the right places. So now I'm going to draw those out and actually I can just use this one even though I already folded it it's a it's one that I don't I'm not worrying about like getting my ink on it because I've already used it for some patterns so let's try the silver one out and all I'm going to do is draw the lines here and that way it will guide me um, when I'm doing my paper trimming, trimmer, I can't talk today. So maybe this is going to show up. I know I, tr I think I tried to use this earlier, well not today, but earlier when I made some of these, but it might not have been on black paper. But as long as you guys have a great imagination, some washi, it doesn't have to be from Simply Gilded. That's why I wanted to do some from Scotch. But you could also, I've got something on my nail. You could also uh, use um, the Recollections washi at, from Michael's that you get in the big tubes. Okay, I got that done on that side. And then I need one more on this side because I need three. So let's make sure I've got this all lined up here. But I'm still not um, feeling 100% yet. It's coming. I can tell I'm feeling better than I did yesterday and so on and so forth. So, pretty much today, I was kind of laid in bed, or sit in bed, with the puppy. And I did these. Oh, come on. And then I'm going to take it across here and I'm going to go ahead and cut. I've got two sheets here. And I'm going to go ahead and cut both of them. Um, that way, if I should make a boo-boo, then I've got an extra one. And you all, you guys don't need me to tell y'all how a paper trimmer works. Let me move this up some. I like the the... the marker or the pen the signo pen whether it's in silver or in a white I like it on here that way I can clearly see where I need to where I need to cut Okay, so yeah, there's a little bit still on this. I probably will flip this over this way and cut it and hole punch it that way. And then we're going to do this other one here. <laughs> My husband said, you should do that. And I'm like, you don't understand. In the crafting world, in the uh, planning world, these girls and gals are girls and guys are talented he's like yeah but they might not have thought of it in a way that you thought of so. and then I started laughing because he's like well if you don't film it I'm gonna go film it and then I'll make a mess of it <laughs> so I was like okay so you won't make a mess I will go in there and film it okay so we got these now they don't have to be perfect 
Like I said, I'm done. I thought I had May already. So I do need all four. So apparently, I didn't have May. I thought I did, but I don't see it anywhere. And I turn my hole punch, when you guys back down now, y'all are going to think I'm having y'all on an elevator ride. I turn my hole punch like where this is, this part is upside down. Because that way it, it allows me to line the holes up. God, that one was tough. There we go. So now I've got June, July, August, September, one for May, and then I've got October. Well, I just threw that. November. And December. I'm only going to um, go through one of these with you guys. Show y'all how I do it. And then. Um, well. Everything just keeps being turned around. What did I do wrong there? Um, I'm only going to go through. And do one with y'all. And then I'm going to. Pause my camera and then um come back and show you guys when i have i was like where is the june <laughs> when i have all of them done Did that mess up again hang on guys okay <clears throat> sorry about that i figured it out i had it upside down and backwards Okay, so this is the one I'm going to do for May. Let me just double check and make sure that I didn't. Well, no, I didn't because here's May. Right here. Okay. So, the washi that I'm going to do for May is um, this one. Oh, God, my camera is. No, my camera and my light is. I'm going to use this one. From um, Simply Gilded. All three of these are from Simply Gilded. But I mean just so you know. Like this one. This combo. This is Scotch. This combo is Sim uh, Simply Gilded and Erin Condren. And then this one is the other one that I'm doing with Erin Condren. I like this combo. So it's Erin Condren and Simply Gilded. So, what I'm going to do here is I want to look back to the last one I did. And that way I'm not laying the stickers down the same way. Or not stickers, the, um, the washi. Okay, so I've got that. And then I'm going to look at these um, and see if I want to use any of these. I like this one that says stay golden and then I like this one that says live love and laugh often I think I'm gonna do that one so I'm gonna leave those right there and I may do some of these seals this one is one that I messed up so move those over there so I do know like what I'm working with and I just knocked my washi off Okay. Oh, there it is. It's dark underneath my desk, so I didn't see it. Okay, so let's see. I had you guys all cattywampus. Okay. I am going to cut this because it's just come unrolled a little bit. I 
have to say, I'm actually nervous about this video. I didn't think I would be, because I like to craft. But, I am. Okay, so we're going to do this, and then these two. So, I need to start. Let's start with this pink one. And I'm thinking... And I'm going to lay that like that. And then I'm going to go ahead and cut. No, I'm not going to cut. I'm going to, yes, I'm going to cut with scissors right here. But to get this one started, because these corners are always hard to do. I'm going to go ahead and trim this one. Okay, I'm going to trim it this way. That way I don't have to be worried about the edge. Um, trying to get this off of the scissors. I'm going to be using a lot of my trash can. Okay. Sorry guys, there's stuff underneath my nails. Right before I started filming this, I was putting new wax in my wax melt and I dropped my lid to my wax melt and um, it spilled wax on me okay so now I'm going let's see I'm going to use my palette knife for, so that I can tear it. Maybe not do it that way. Okay, so we'll just cut it. So I'm going to need this one again. Well, I'm going to need all of them again. Okay, and then we're going to pull this one. Oh, no. I just do what I thought I did. No, I did. I thought the bowl was upside down. <laughs> and I know hers that's with the bows tend to run opposite direction. You see how that one pulled opposite of the the black one there? I don't know why she does that. I'm trying to decide. I think I want to put the black between them this one is one of those that you could run it either way because like one set of bows is upside down okay and then we're going to do the pink and since this has gold in it the washi has gold in it I'm not going to use the silver I'll just use the um the white pen if this is videos that you guys like seeing please give the video a thumbs up and comment in the description like something you would like to see me craft and also um, I've been asking my husband for critiques because he um, he knows me the best about how um, to shorten my videos and he's helped me out a lot. He watched one of my past videos and he's like, yeah, you were kind of doing a, a lot of rambling. So I am sorry. We're going to do this. This is the last time that I'm going to do 
No, I need to scoot that down. So. Last time I'm going to do the black washi. And then I'm going to cap it off since we started with the pink. I'm going to cap it off with the pink. And put these together. And like I said, you can do this with any washi. It doesn't matter where you got your washi from. I just... When I first started into planning, I um, seen everybody using Simply Gilded. And so I wanted to use Simply Gilded. So I had the subscription box and then I got to realizing that um, I still had washi in packages that had never been opened and I wasn't using it. So, that's when I canceled my subscription, but I had I already have, like, I can't even bring the, well, I guess I could. It's just, it's got stuff on it. I just dropped all my sticker books in the floor. Yep, I did that. So, this whole thing is full of washi. I guess you say I didn't learn my lesson too soon. Okay, now that I got all that picked up. Okay, I'm just going to pull this off of my lovely cardboard here. And then I'm just going to, I'm going to turn it over like this so that I can see the paper. And once I let her uh, May out, then I will. Oh, here are one of our dogs barking. Now, Callie is spouting um, in the sunroom because she's. We've never leash trained the two puppies outside, and I haven't been able to with me having this ivy in my arm. And. Um, so she's going in, my husband's dropping her off uh, this Saturday for surgery. She's not going to have surgery till Monday, but they're going to keep her since I can't take her with this IV in my arm. And so he put a collar on her.